More than $300,000. That is how much one park in Spring Valley is going to cost to repair. Almost three years ago, it was closed to two fires in one month. And 13 Action News reporter Cynthia Maldonado right now is live at the Spring Valley Community Park with concerns from parents. Cynthia. Todd, well, parents say their kids are forced to play in this park, which is the little kids park, but in reality, they want to play. Follow me over here at that big park over there. And as you can see, it's fenced off and it's off limits to everyone. Diego and Connor, Keep pushing it, Connor are keeping cool at the splash pad at the Spring Valley Community Park. But you see that big fenced playground behind them? It's been closed off for almost three years. The boys call it the Big Kids Park and would rather play there. Because it's fun and cool. The other playground next to it is too small. Tammy Quinones couldn't agree more. She's Diego's mom. You get older kids that are six or older, that's a little bit too small for them to play on. You get more little babies, maybe four and under on that one. The playground was shut down in December of 2016 after two fires in one month. Parents back then claimed the fires were caused by homeless people. Clark County did not confirm that. At this point, the bigger question is, when will it open? It's sad that it's still down and we're wondering why. Connor's mom, Jasmine, says it was their go-to park. But if it was open, we'd come a lot more. Clark County replied to a tweet saying, this project is scheduled for construction later this year and finishing up in early 2020. For anyone that's under 21, parks are very a necessity for here, especially if you have younger ones. And until this playground gets a makeover, the splash pad it's fun. will have to be the big kids park. And in that park, you still see melted tubes, charred chains. And I also found out from the county, it's going to cost the $320,000 to fix it. Now, when do the repairs start? We don't have an exact date for that. Reporting in Spring Valley, Cynthia Maldonado, 13 Action News. Cynthia, thank you.